and they are living in a very peaceful uh, world, almost like a fairy tale in Australia, but still we cannot disassociate our connections to other human beings, the suffering and uh, the, the tragic life of our uh, global human community. Unfortunately, refugee situation today reflects our human conditions and uh, in almost every nation has to come out a new answer about how we look at our humanity and human rights in uh, today's condition. And uh, Australia is a um, nation of migrants and it's culture and its booming is only because we are mixed, we can accept and uh, tolerate the difference. And, uh, but Australia's uh, refugee record uh, is not, it's quite poor internationally, which gave a very bad position for a state. Anything for those people who is unfortunate, lost their voice, never had a chance to look at the sky again, not a possibility to feel the ocean again. I would do anything for them. China has always been a um, you know, emperor state. It doesn't matter, it has its title of communist, now capitalism, but uh, it's, it's, a, it's a fatalistic society. So a change leader or not changing leader, the system and the culture always stays the same. I would not say a region would have no end. It's a dream of the region. And uh, China is developing in many ways. And uh, people, the life getting better. You see so many uh, youngsters study outside. And I think the, the Western um, idea or to, to respect very basic um, human um, values have become more and more important for society to maintain the competition. <laughs>